summer girl, summer girl, yeah, yeah, summer girl. Look at my summer outfit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the friends, I get asked all the time about cravings. Nicole, I'm eating in a calorie deficit. I'm trying to lose weight, but I get so many cravings. Is this normal? Do you get cravings? Yes, it's normal. Yes, I get cravings. And lately, I've been getting cravings for chips and ice cream quite often. But if you watch my la one of my latest videos, you'll know I'm trying to reshape my body and get in the best shape that I possibly can, and it's working. I'm starting to fit in my first size five. So in this video, I'm gonna share, whew, I'm out of breath. <laughs> in this video, I'm gonna share with you my current snack hacks or low calorie food swaps that I'm using to satisfy my cravings, but also still stay on track so that I can eat in a calorie deficit and get lean, but not mean. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. I'm really excited about these and the cool thing about these swaps is that you get to eat more food for the same or less calories than the thing you're craving. What? I'm in. All right, so crackers. Crackers are one of like my favorite things. I do actually crave them and my favorite is toppables. So I'm just gonna visit my cheat sheet here. For five toppables, it's 90 calories, so five crackers. Or you can eat 36 goldfish for the same calories, for 90 calories. You get way more food, it's less fat, and they come in amazing flavors. Like this one is explosive pizza and Parmesan, and these are amazing. And because they're so full of flavor, one serving really is satisfying. Next, chips. Like I said, I've been really craving chips lately, but for 36 chips, it's like 300, sorry, for 30 Lay's chips, it's like 320 calories. So I found these crispy minis and you can eat 30 of these for 270 calories. 30. 30, look at how much you get. And these are amazing, like the cheesy nacho. They also come in creamy ranch. They kind of taste like Doritos actually. And they're really satisfying. You can eat a ton and they really satisfy my chip craving. So me and Nicole were talking off camera and you see a lot of things on Instagram, YouTube, where people mean well but their suggestions to swap out just aren't gonna cut it. Yeah. Like if you have a chip craving, they'll say, eat grapes instead. You know what's funny? I was looking on Pinterest the other day for craving hacks, and it said, if you're craving like sweet and sugary things, eat spinach and sweet potato. And I'm like, spinach and sweet potato is great, but not when you're craving like a cookie or no. a donut. I need to have as close to the real thing as possible because that's what helps me stay on track. And we personally selected and test out these things every day so we can recommend to you guys very, very similar foods. We eat all of these things because we do get cravings, but we like to stay on track with our diet. And all low so, calorie food is not made equal. We choose no, the best. We choose the best ones that taste super similar. And my next craving, granola. I love granola. The problem with granola is it's marketed as healthy and it may be, but it's also usually pretty high in calorie. So Harvest Crunch is one of my favorite granolas. For two thirds of a cup, it's 210 calories. Or you can choose kids cereal, like these Apple Jacks, and you can have more, three quarters of a cup, for 110 calories. So you get more for less calories, and these are amazing. You can put them in your yogurt and make a parfait with berries and stuff, and it'll taste like a yogurt parfait with granola, but way less calories you than get, that. You get the crunch, what I love about these, you get the crunch, you get the cinnamon flavor, the apple flavor, it, they're great. And look at how much you get for a little over 100 calories, like that's amazing.
And my next craving, ice cream. Kyle and I, if you are new, like we're ice cream lovers to like the extreme. Like ice cream is one of our favorite desserts. I've been craving it a lot lately. So you can eat like half a cup of the Ben and Jerry's. I used half baked just to get an idea of calories. Half a cup of Ben and Jerry's half baked is 270 calories or you can get Halo Top, and depending on the calories, this one is oatmeal cookie. For three quarters of a cup, it's 120 calories, so you get way more ice cream for way less calories. So for the same, I wrote this out, um, for one and a half cups, it's the same, it's 240 calories. So you can get way more ice cream for way less, or you can eat three of these, creamsicle bars. You could have one in each flavor. It comes in three flavors. You can eat three of them for, let me check my little cheat sheety, 210 calories. Isn't that crazy? Like, yes. look at how much ice cream you can have. Now, we're not, we are crazy, but we're not totally crazy. So when we say these swaps, we're not saying that Halo Top is as good as Ben and Jerry's. But I would say like, these things are not gonna be 10 out of 10 the exact thing. They're gonna be eight out of 10 though. That Halo Top is really good. It's amazing and it satisfies my ice cream craving. Of course, every once in a while we give ourselves the real thing, but because we choose these most of the time, we never go off track. There is no track because it's a lifestyle change, not a diet, and we love our food. And usually, like we're showing you guys, with the low calorie stuff, you get more. So like three bars or like more cereal, more of this ice cream. Yeah, like. If, if somebody said to me today, Nicole, you can have ice cream. Do you want half a cup of Ben and Jerry's or do you want one and a half cups of Halo Top? Yeah. I like eating a lot, so I would choose the one and a half cups. Especially when you find things that are very similar to Doritos or something where you get way more of the serving size. That's what I, I'm going to choose the more all the time because I'm a big eater and I have a big appetite and I love food. <laughs> Uh, chocolate is another one of my biggest cravings. So four to five squares of chocolate, uh, like a Hershey's chocolate bar, let's say, is about 200 calories. Or for 140 calories, you can have two tablespoons of mini chocolate chips. Look how much you get. Way more chocolate for way less calories, and these are so amazing because it feels like you're eating so much for only 140 calories, that is. And it really satisfies my craving. I love those. And you guys can imagine, like Nicole's eating about 1,900 to 2,000 calories a day. Yeah. You can imagine with our three basic meals, how many and how much of these snacks for 100 or 200 calories you can add into your day to make it fun to lose weight. Exactly, like I choose fruits and veggies and lean protein most of the time and then when I'm craving something I put in one of these and I can eat a lot of it because it's so low calorie <laughs> my mind every time cookies is another one of my favorite things two two Oreo cookies I think is hundred and forty calories let me yeah two Oreo cookies is hundred and forty calories or you can have two sheets of graham crackers so that's one two three four so you would get eight of these small crackers eight for 130 calories. Or you can have a whole package of these chocolate thins from Walmart, the great value, for 100 calories. And they taste like Oreos without the cream. Or you can have two Fig Newtons for 110 calories. And these are bigger than Oreos and they're still yummy cookies for less calories. I love all of those and I include all of them when I'm craving cookies and it really does satisfy that craving. The last one, candy. Now, Kyle's not like a big candy fan, but I am. And I've been craving candy too. But for my favorite candy is watermelon slices. And for 10 pieces, it's 130 calories. Or you can get the fruit flavored marshmallows, like the multicolor mini ones, two thirds of a cup. Look at how much that is for 100 calories. 100? Yes. 100 calories. Look how many marshmallows you get. And I learned if you get the multicolored ones, they have less sugar than the white mini marshmallows. That's crazy. So you go the multicolor and because they're fruit flavored, they get out my candy craving because they're sweet and they taste like fruit, just like the watermelons. And I, I was actually skeptical that they would taste different. And I thought maybe they'd just be dyed different. No, they actually have individual flavors. They really do. So it, it really like, it's a 
for me, it's a perfect candy alternative um, because a lot of people, I was sharing like the smart sweets and a lot of people are like, oh, those are so expensive. Well, marshmallows are super cheap and you get a lot of them for, for very few calories. Yeah, we go in the grocery store, guys, because we love food and we do all the research for you. So I dare you to try some of these. Tell us they're not good. Seriously, guys, like if you're having a craving, these honestly, they will satisfy you and you'll be like, wow, I'm losing weight and loving it. And watch this. Want to watch this? <laughs> Kyle and I have lost 130 pounds each and kept it off for six years because we allow ourselves to satisfy our cravings and eat foods that we love. If you want to know exactly what we ate to lose our first and next 50 pounds, we have two weight loss guides. Check out the links down below. Exact portions, exact meal plans, family friendly recipes. What? It's all in there. Check it out if you want. Watch these two videos. Get some of these foods and love it. And do this. Shake your beam. This is beam for PG for YouTube. Shake your beam and shake your beam and do the lumber. No, I have a question. What if I can't do what you just did? Just um, improvise. Like you can just go, <laughs> or you can just go. Anyone can shake their beam. Come on, everyone can do this. Okay, I'll try it. Shake it, and then be a summer, summer friend. Summer <laughs> friend, summer friend. This is how you be a summer friend. <laughs> we love you. Thanks for watching and all your support. Love you. Peace and out. See you guys. See ya. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.